Okay, so today we're going to change the bow cover gasket to a 2007 Chevy Avio. And this is the reason why. Okay, so first, we're going to be taking out these four. Very good. Voice. Okay, so you're going to loosen all these up. Take all these out. Which is a 10 millimeter, 10 millimeter socket, and then once you get those out, this will just you just pull these out. Which, as you can see, my wires are bad, and so are my spark plugs. So we're gonna be changing those too. That'll be a different video though, so don't worry. Okay, so. Now we got all the screws out. Like I said, this, you just pull them out. Easy as can be. This, you're going to pull and get this disconnected. You wiggle it out. It's going to take probably two hands. You just use something to clamp these together and pull that out. And then you have a little clip right here, and it'll just pull out. Again, take a second look at it. Okay, I'll get back to you when I get that part done. Okay, so now I've got everything just attached. So this piece, we're just gonna pull it up. Gonna wiggle it, give it a little bit of wiggle room. But wiggle it out, and I'm gonna get that done real fast because it's gonna take two hands. But wiggle it out, and I'll show you what it'll look like. Okay, so with replacing the spark plugs and wires, I'm going to clean down each side of one of those. It's a rag because there shouldn't be any oil down in there. Clean it out before I put them back in. And then I'll show you the next step. Okay, so now that we got this off, right over here, we're actually going to take the plastic piece off of this. I'll do those around, but we're going to clean this trim all the way around it. Just wipe it off, make sure there's no gunk on it. So that's going to affect the way if it sticks on there properly. So I'll do that real quick and then I'll show you what it should look like. Okay, so now I got the, the trim cleaned. All around, no, we're, nothing's going to make it where it's going to leak out still and continue this mess. Okay, so now we just got to take it off of the top part. is isn't too hard. Just that snapped. It isn't too hard, but I'm going to do it off camera so I can use both my hands. I'll show you what it looks Okay, so now that I have the trim out, as you can see, Here's the new one, and what you're going to do is you're going to place it in there, just how the other one was, exactly like the, how the other one was, and you're going to push it down inside the hole, just how you took it out, all the way around, do the circles, do that real quick and I'll show you what it'll look like. Okay, so that's what it should look like, make sure it's pushed in everywhere, as far as it can go in. Okay, so now, look to the other side, I'm going to take out every one of those little washers, because it comes with new ones. All the little washers in there, take them out, replace them with the new ones. I'm going to do that real quick, and I'll show you what it should look like. Okay, so the rigs are on, so now you're good to put the this piece back over top of it, and start putting the screws back in. Okay, so I got it back on there. Now I just have to put the screws back in everywhere. You notice it's going to have a little gap, but once the screws go in, it's going to apply its pressure where it needs to be. And then that's how you change that. Hope this video helped you. Um, if you did, please leave a thumbs up. If you want to see more stuff done to this car, also leave in the comment, let me know. 
Got a long job ahead of me, and I will see you all later. Okay, so that's what it should look like. Been normal. Um, hope this video helped. Hope everything helped. Uh, it was a lot of work, but it would drive a lot better. Be a lot better off. Oh, uh, the wires were literally just burning in two, so glad that got fixed. Spark plugs need to change anyways. One was actually starting to crack, so I'm glad I got that out while I could, did. Um, and again, as you can tell, it was already pouring out size, so I'm glad I got the trim fixed on that. So, uh, I hope this video helped you learn how to do everything to the AVO, and I will see you all soon with more videos.